Welcome back. From robots to apps, innovations providing a fest for the mind at NDSU today. This group of NDSU students is in fierce competition for some big money and some likely recognition as well with their creations, all aiming at developing the next big thing. Take, for example, what Michelle Savageau and her team came up with, something school districts can use and not have to buy to help students focus on STEM learning, science, technology, engineering, and math. Using Michelle's team's plan, they would have all the pieces in what they call a star kit, aimed at challenging students in those areas. Teachers would have access to an online website where they could go on, um, be a catalog with all our items, and then they'd just pick, click on one, they'd rent it out for a couple weeks, use it in their classroom, and then they'd just bring it back to us and we'd get it to another school. She knows what she's doing. The winners of the competition will be announced next, uh, near the end of next year. At stake, some $20,000 in prizes. Cracked, dry, itchy skin. It's one of the many side effects experienced over the winter, but there is a solution to stop the suffering. Professionals at Catalyst Medical Center say that there are some at-home remedies that can help, including taking showers that aren't nearly as hot as you usually do. And the medical estheticians say that the hot water can dry out your skin and say that after you shower, it's important to moisturize right away. For those with other skin problems, the winter can be the perfect time to maybe get some procedures done. For at-home recipes of skincare products, go to valleynewslive.com and look for this story. That's our own Christy Larson. It was. She was getting pampered today. Sacrificing herself for the story. <laughs> uh, that's yes. good. Up next in sports, an <laughs> annual event as we gear up for the Super Bowl, Media Day Hoopla, when we return.